Welcome to Rhino CFD Basics. In this video we will give an overview of the turbulence models contained within Rhino CFD and the situations in which you may find each one of them useful. A little bit of background. Turbulence is an incredibly difficult phenomenon to predict numerically and takes an extraordinary amount of computational power to solve directly. This led to the development of Reynolds Average Navier-Stokes or RANS equations. These simplify the turbulent behavior using a statistical averaging process, but leave unknown turbulent correlations. Turbulence models then use a set of relations and equations in order to determine these unknowns. Rhino CFD contains a vast number of turbulence models, which allows users to apply the correct method to their specific problem. To view them, open up the main menu, click on Models, and then on the button for Turbulence Models, which is set to the default KE Chen. Starting from the top, the turbulence model options are the laminar model. It is used for simulating laminar flow, low Reynolds numbers rather than turbulent flow with high Reynolds numbers. Constant effective. This model has shown to be advantageous when modeling complex geometry or for spaced average approaches such as modeling a bank of heat exchanger two bundles. It can also be used as an initial check to see if a model has been set up correctly as it is known to have good convergent properties and is very efficient. LVEL model. LVEL stands for Length Scale Times Velocity model. It is very computationally efficient and is especially useful for flows through spaces cluttered with many objects such as pipe flow or electronics cooling. K Epsilon model. The standard KE model is probably the most widely used turbulence model used today. It provides relatively low computational expense and good convergence for a wide range of turbulent flows. K Omega model. It is also a very popular model. It has proven to show good results when modeling flow close to geometry, for example flow past turbine blades. Other variants. KE variants. This contains a list of models which are based on the K epsilon model, but have been modified for specific situations. Low Reynolds number models. These models are suitable for analyzing flow at very low Reynolds numbers, and are commonly used to analyze flow next to walls. Others. This contains a range of more complex turbulence models used for very specific flow problems. KE Chen. This model applies the Ken Chim improvements to the KE model and is the default turbulence model in Rhino CFD. This model offers advantages when simulating flow with recirculation areas. Clicking on settings allows you to set various parameters and constants for each of the turbulence models. Thanks for watching this Rhino CFD Basics video. For more information, please visit rhinocfd.com.